What's going on guys? This is Riggs. Thank you so much for tuning into the channel. A video, a video that I didn't think I would ever be able to make. I've been thinking about this video, like this video, since what happened happened. <clears throat> for those of you guys that don't know, I imagine the majority of you guys watching this do know, but for those of you guys for possibly that don't know, is the YouTube channel is hacked. We don't necessarily know by who. We don't necessarily even know exactly how. The fact of the matter is the channel was hacked by somebody who wanted to take this channel down, that wanted, they did not do it for monetary gain. They did it to basically destroy the channel and get it removed from YouTube. And that's what I'm gonna be talking about in this video. I'm gonna be talking to you guys, I'm gonna give you guys um, a recollection of what exactly happened from from when I first noticed that the my account was compromised all the way until right now, me making this video and everything that transpired in between. So, and I'll also be posting, you know, some pictures up and, you know, things like that. But I definitely want to thank you for watching this. If you're watching, I, again, there's been so many emotions. Some words can't even express some of the emotions that not only me, not only me, that's the thing. It's never even... I don't even want to make this necessarily about me. This is about the community. This is about, you know, again, I don't even know like how to start, but it's never about me. It's about you guys. Um, but I'll get into all that. So basically, um, what the, when I first found a lot of people have asking, well, how'd you find it? How'd you even know? I got, I got off work. It was on August 16th. I got off work. I just... I got off work, I turned on my phone, I opened up my phone, you know, I clicked on the YouTube app just to open it and it said, um, you know, please sign in. Hmm, that's kind of weird. I've never had that happen before. So what do I do? I go ahead, I go and I sign in and it didn't let me. And I'm like, well, that's kind of weird. So then um, I asked some people, and the, oh, so then I went to Riggs Gaming. I just searched it regular. And I saw that my banner had changed. It was like a, it was like a mountain range. And if you open up YouTube on your phone, if you have a channel, it has like a little, like the little settings, little button where you can click that and start, you know, doing some things. That little button was gone. And I was like, so I was, at that point I was viewing my channel just as if anybody was. So then I asked some people in Discord, on my Discord server, hey, what do you guys see on the channel right now? Um, and they said, oh, you know, we see like a mountain range. Why did you post that? And I'm like, I didn't post that. So then, so now we're starting to, now we're starting to panic a little bit. So I'm like, what the hell's going on? So then I, I hit up, um, I hit up my buddy, Spooby, who told me, to, to do, do this troubleshooting, this link, where if your account, account's been taken over, how to get access to your account back. So I go, I open up the link, I, you know, I click on it, oh, it opens up, and it says, um, if your account's, you know, been compromised, you know, or account hijacking, you know, click that. So I click that. And then it asks you the security questions, but all the security questions had been changed. I noticed that the email was not my email anymore because I have a Gmail email account. This was an at MSN. When it asked, can you, to, to, to proceed, you had to type in the name of the account holder. So I type in my name and it says invalid. So I'm like, what the hell is going on? And then I can also see all the activity that had been on my account within the last 30 days. And it showed that someone had logged into my account from the United Arab Emirates. So this is when I'm really starting to freaking panic. I finally am able, you know, everyone in Discord is just in this just full panic mode. So I don't know what's going on. And I had videos scheduled to be uploaded. I mean, it was just a mess. But it, and also I forgot to mention the comment section was also disabled. So someone, the person disabled the comments and they changed the banner, but it still said Riggs Gaming. It still had my profile picture on there. No videos had been deleted. And also the uh, no videos were monetized at that point. There was no zero monetization. So then I go ahead 
and I email YouTube. I finally get a good email. I tried to call their phone number. I don't know if you ever tried to call Google or YouTube, but you can't apparently. You get sent to an automated recording that just sends you to the website. It's the biggest joke ever. So I end up and I email YouTube support. To my surprise, they emailed me the very next day. I emailed them Saturday, they responded Sunday. But it was a very, very bland, just a super generic email saying, you know, hey, you know, thank you for contacting us. You know, we'll look into it. Um, you know, basically have a nice day. It was an email like that. It's like, wow. The most frustrating thing is my account was still there. It was there. I could look at it. I could watch my videos. And that was without a doubt one of the most frustrating things, knowing that I could still see my account. A lot of people also mentioned about Bushka. You know, the same thing happened to Bushka. The difference is his account necessarily didn't get hacked. YouTube themselves removed his account, right? They were able to remove his account. The, the, the difference here is someone hacked into my account and I could still see it. My account wasn't removed. And that was what was making it so frustrating. And no one even knew about it. No one even, no one knew what was, you know, what was going on. And it's like, YouTube, just look, you can see it. It's my freaking account. I had any question that they could ask me, I'd be able to answer. And I, I'd be able to prove that the account is mine. But you get the cookie cutter responses. And that was, that's what was making this harder and harder each day because it almost seemed like, you know, they didn't care. I could prove it. You know, I knew it, everybody else knew it, but I wasn't, they were not giving me the time of day. And it's very, very hard to get a hold of these, you know, these faceless machines, um, you know, like YouTube and Google. I mean, good luck. So, Again, there, there, no damage was being done. The, the, none of my emails had been deleted, nothing like that. And this went on for a good, for a good week, week and a half. And then I started noticing some changes to the channel. The banner changed again, just to like a, you know, I, I don't know the country, I don't know anything like that. I'm not trying to offend anybody or anything like that, but it was like an Asian um, banner, you know, with like Asian, you know, people on it. There was an Asian guy in the profile picture, and the account name was changed to, it was NGO Dung. I don't know, Nagao Dung. I don't know how to pronounce it, but Nagao Dung, something like that. So that's, um, so now I'm really starting to get worried because now I'm starting to see these things where the account has been changed. So my understanding is the, the person who hacked the account and took it over ended up selling it. Uh, to this person or this group or whatever. But again, nothing had been posted. Nothing, um, no videos had been posted, no videos had been deleted, nothing like that. So I'm like, what's going on? It's just, you're, it's like you're trapped outside of your own body and you can't do anything. And then that is when it started. I want to, I, I believe it was on Thursday. What was that? August, I don't know. August 29th, something like that. The unthinkable happened where the person started posting videos. Not only were they posting videos, they were posting multiple videos every single minute. Think about that. Every single minute. Understand in a 24 hour, in a 24 hour time span, dude was able to post over 25 2,500 videos. Think about that. 2,500 freaking videos in 24 hours. To put that in perspective, because that might just seem like a number right now. But 2,500 videos. Understand, there's only, there's 1,440 minutes in a day. And in, in 24 hours, there's 1,440 minutes. He was able to post more videos than there are minutes in a day. Some minute or some minutes there'd be five videos. Some minutes there'd be two. A slower minute there'd only be one video per minute. Um, and it was nonstop, and it just kept going and going and going. It would not stop. 
And then this is when the unthinkable, so the, the unthinkable already happened, but now the damage, this is where the damage started occurring and still is with, with the subscribers. Because people were constantly getting, you know, uh, getting these notifications and people would open up their YouTube account or they'd open up their YouTube, they'd see their feed and they would just see all these, you know, these crazy videos from, from Japanese anime to Judge Judy and everything in between. Some, you know, um, I don't know, Japanese or, or like, you know, Chinese game shows. Everything you could think of was being uploaded. And some of these videos were three hours long. Some videos were 10 minutes. I, I, can you, three, it's like, what is happening? How is this happening? Was it a bot? Was it a person? Like, it was insane. Um, and then the damage started happening where people started unsubbing because all people saw was Nagao Dung in their feed saying that they uploaded a video. And they're like, who is this? How did I subscribe to this person? Not knowing it's my account. You know, no one knew. I don't expect them to. I probably would have unsubscribed too. I don't even blame them. The fact of the matter is we lost over 4,000. We lost over 4,000 subscribers in less than a day. That is absolutely devastating. Anyone that's possibly watching this that's a content creator or, I mean, just having something stolen. I don't know if you've ever had like your car broken into or your home broken into. I hope not. But I don't know if you've ever had something stolen from you or if you've had something stolen out of your backpack. Just anything taken from you. That feeling of invasion, the, the, of your privacy being invaded like that, something being taken from you that you have worked so hard for, and the point, you know, just all that, just the countless amounts of hours and days building not only this channel, you guys, but building a community, seeing that crumble before my eyes. was without a doubt the most devastating thing and I'll never I'll, it's, it's it's an experience this is something that I will never ever forget um but before we get into that before I close this out I, um you know I don't want the video again like I always say I don't want the videos to get too long right but I know they do when the videos first started being uploaded something else unthinkable happened um, this is when the community and the army started to form and come together. And I don't use this app that often, but I'm going to start. I promise you that. And that is Twitter. My good buddy, Charizard Freak, which I know we probably couldn't be any more different, but my good buddy, Charizard Freak did something I didn't even ask. He did it all on his own. He went to Twitter he tagged me, he tagged YouTube support, and he tagged Powerbank, saying, hey, Riggs, uh, you know, Riggs Gaming, his account got hacked, he's uploading videos, he's trying to get his channel taken down, get copyright striked, and this and that, you know, you know, we need your help. And I want to say within minutes, within minutes, I couldn't believe it. Powerbank freaking responded. That was like the most insane thing ever to see Powerbank respond. Not only that, but you know, when he replied, you know, he ends up tagging me in it as well. And, and he replied saying, give me about a day. Uh, give me about a day. You know, just sit tight. A bunch of people were blown up. Um, so so now Powerbank knows. And then a bunch, all of you guys, uh Again, without even being asked, just doing it on your own. This, this, this is incredible. A bunch of you guys hit up Bushka and we're like, Bushka, like, you know, we need your help. Like, we need to get this channel back, especially Bushka because he had something very devastating happen to his account as well. Um, and then he posts a community tab. And I, I want to say that his post got over a thousand likes on it versus other posts might have like 50 or 60. This post he posted got a thousand likes. That's how hard you guys were going. I have never, in a good way, 
but I've never been tagged so many times in my life. I've never had so many people join the Discord server in such a short amount of time. I've never had this amount of support. Granted, we lost 4,000 subscribers, but the people that rallied, that did the saber rattling, you guys that were going to my channel and telling YouTube, hey, something's not right here. I mean, hundreds of you guys were hammering YouTube saying, this guy's account has been hacked, look at it. And then finally, um, something, some progress was made and it was solely, and I, I could not believe it. It's literally, I don't want to use the terms like idols or anything like that, but definitely the person I've always respected and I've always watched their videos is power banks. I mean, we're talking about since the clash of clan days and watch pretty much every single video in between. No, I'm not always commenting and those things, but I can tell you I pretty much have seen all his videos probably since he's been out of 50,000 subscribers. And to have that, you know, someone like that, um, someone, you know, that you look up to, he slid in my DMs. I shit you not, he literally, he DM'd me saying, I need this, 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 and this. And I'm like, wow, I like got the chills. It was insane. So I got him, you know, like the URL to the channel. It's just a bunch of different things we don't need to get into, but um, questions he was asked and I, you know, got him the information. He whisked it off, you know, to, you know, his people because he knows a lot of people, you know, at YouTube. And um, finally, I got an email from somebody from YouTube, uh, like a real, like a real person, someone who actually cares from YouTube, um, saying that, you know, they're gonna get this taken care of, just give them some time, this and that. And then finally the video stopped being uploaded. Then I saw the videos um, begin to get deleted. Very, I mean, we're talking hundreds of videos being deleted a second. It was like, bah, 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 bah. it was insane. So then that happened. Then my channel was taken down and then some things happen and we have to basically, they basically took my channel, they took the face off my channel and put it like on a brand new canvas, on like a brand new channel. They call it a brand account. So it's the same channel, just it's like a cut and paste because um, the old one was already, you know, tainted, you know, with the, with the hacker, it was already associated with him now or them. Um, but I cannot thank Charizard Freak enough. Words, videos, nothing will ever be able to, to, it'll never be enough. I cannot thank Charizard Freak enough for contacting me. Even I've talked to him before, but doing it like this. For him to go out of his way and tag Powerbang when he didn't need to. No one needed to do any of this. That's what's so amazing about it. No one had to do anything. It could have been anyone else and they could have said, ah, you know, whatever, just moving on. But the fact is, uh, literally an entire community lifted up and made this happen. This would not have happened unless I truly believe that YouTube would not have done anything without the help of you guys reporting the videos, reporting the account, power bang, you know, getting his people involved because he knows, you know, some of the higher ups in YouTube. Um, and him and I were DMing, I would DM him, giving him updates of the account. And I promise you within, within five minutes, he'd respond. And I'm like, you know, sorry to bug you. He's like, not at all. Like he's the most chill down to earth person ever. I was talking to, but you know, big shout to Bushka, big shout to Spooby HD for setting me up. Cause he's the one who gave me the link to email YouTube support from the very beginning when this happened two weeks ago. Um, <clears throat> And then again, the community itself, I don't know what I would have done without Discord. Um, it would have been very, very, very lonely, a very, very lonely space. Um, but we did it. We're here. I, I, I've been thinking about, like I said, I've been thinking about this video for weeks. And here it is. I cannot believe it. We're going to come back. Another thing I want to talk about is real quick before I end the video. This is usually when someone would insert the part where it's like, 
you know, you never know what you have until it's gone. You know, I'm going to, you know, appreciate, you know, so-and-so or, you know, this thing more because of this experience. The thing is, I've always appreciated the Riggs Army. I've always appreciated the views, the likes, the comments. You know, that's why I'm so active in the comment section. That's why my Discord server is literally, there's literally people chatting in there. To, to, at, at this point, probably 23 hours in a 24 hour time frame, or 23 hours in a 24 hour time frame, there's literally always somebody talking. There's always people talking in the, the chit chat channel of the of Discord. Um, and I've always appreciated the views. That's why I call this the biggest small channel on YouTube. When you look at the amount of subscribers we have, granted I lost 4,000, but if you look at the amount of subscribers that, that I have or that we have, you compare that to the amount of likes, views, and comments, no channel comes close, especially the comments. The comments, you guys are insane in the comment section. It's ridiculous. Um, but I've always appreciated the channel. All I can say to you guys is I'm going to continue doing what I've been doing. I'm going to continue bringing you guys, you know, the live streams. I cannot wait to do the, the very first live stream. It's going to be insane. I'm going to keep doing the live streams. I'm going to keep posting you guys daily gaming videos. You know, specifically PUBG Mobile right now. Um, but I'm going to be doing daily uploads like I have been. I'm going to be answering your guys' comments like I have been. The comments I don't answer, I leave hearts. I'll be leaving hearts like I have been. Because I've always appreciated you guys. I know, I know that I'm lucky to be in this space. And the fact that this community is able to make, was able to make it happen to I was able to get my channel back. It's insane. So Charizard Freak, Spooby, Bushka, Power, of course, Power Bang, like Power Bang more than anybody. I'm gonna give a big shout out to Brazen as well. Um, oh, and a big shout out, big, big shout out. I forgot one more very, very important person. And that's when Sandy, he also took to Twitter telling people do not unsub because he knew what was going on and what was going to happen. So big, big shout out to um, Winsanity. Um, all these people, I, I could not have done it without you guys. And of course, everybody in Discord and everyone who commented, you know, what's going on. And now, if you're, now you know. Now you know what happened. Hopefully this video didn't get too long. I have a lot of work to do. We got to get some videos uploaded. Of course, like, comment, subscribe. We got to rebuild. We lost 4,000 subscribers in, in less than a day. Um, yeah, hopefully this video did not get too long. I appreciate each and every one of you. Share this video, share the channel. We gotta, we gotta rebuild. We got a lot of, lot, a lot of work to do. Um, so yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. But I don't even know how to end this video. It's, it's, it's so insane what's happened. But hopefully I answered all your guys' questions. I'll be answering every single comment in the comment section. Every single comment I'll be responding to. Um, so anyway. We're back. Could not, I could not be happier to be back. And just thank you guys so much. But until the next video, this has been Riggs from Riggs Gaming.